Number 1 Little Penguin Observation Center The smallest penguin species, the little penguin, has a colony on Bernie's foreshore, a brief walk from the CBD. There's an observation center on the boardwalk here, staffed by volunteer guides. You'll be given a rare window on the little penguin's seasonal life, from courtship to rearing chicks and then molting at the end of the breeding season. Number 2 Bernie Regional Museum Bernie's 200 years of European history is revealed at this top-notch museum, holding the third largest collection in the state. The exhibition, on Federation Street, drops you into a Bernie Street scene at the beginning of the 20th century. Number 3 Helliers Road Distillery Tasmania is an island dotted with distilleries, making the most of the most of its pure mountain streams and grains nourished by a temperate climate. Despite the stiff competition, Helliers Road's single malt has been acclaimed as the country's best by the Malt Whiskey Association of Australia. Number 4 Burney Park Once a private garden, Burney's main urban park was bought by the city in the 1920s. There are neat flower beds planted with annuals, rambling walkways and flowing lawns under mature exotic and native trees. The high ground also gives Burney Park some lovely views of the Bay Strait. Number 5 Burney Regional Art Gallery Another way to tap into Burney's dynamic arts community is at this gallery, serving the northwest and west coasts of Tasmania. True to the city's heritage as a papermaking hub, the Regional Gallery has assembled a nationally important collection of print and art on paper. Number 6 Fern Glade Reserve On the east bank of the Emu River, before it swoops into Emu Bay, there's a beautiful reserve bedded in the valley. There's a wonderful variety of natural life along the riverside paths at the Fern Glade Reserve, from wallabies to lush tree ferns, orchids, unusual fungi, and birds like the Tasmanian native hen. Number 7 Guide Falls be sure to make time for a drive into Bernie's idyllic hinterland to discover this tiered cascade waterfall in a pristine natural reserve. The base of Guide Falls is an easy 10-minute walk from the car park, and there's a steep stairway up to a platform for a stunning view from above. Number 8 Emu Valley Rhododendron Garden If you're in Bernie between the end of August and January you have to make the short trip to this garden in a natural amphitheater just outside the city. Growing here in 11 hectares are more than 22,000 rhododendron and companion plants, which burst into flower for those few months. Number 9 Guide Falls Farm For families visiting Guide Falls there's a working farm that welcomes visitors for animal encounters. A self-guided tour around the paddocks will take around two hours, during which you'll meet deer, alpacas, peacocks, emus, rabbits, sheep and pigs, to name just a handful. Number 10 West Beach Also known as simply Burney Beach, West Beach is just a block from the CBD and is joined by the boardwalk to the Little Penguin Observation Center. Come on a sunny day and this is an agreeable place to linger, with a wide arc of sand and a generous foreshore equipped with picnic tables and barbecues. Hope you like this video for more videos please subscribe to our channel.